I came across some findings. Mm, yes. <laughs> yes. First of all, there is blood serum with Maya's name labeled in on it in the freezer. My sister's name? And blood doesn't last that long. Well, the research clip for it was called Eve. Eve? Then Eve really is. My sister. It appears to have been made up of liver cells. He was culturing them in the past. What do you mean? What for? I don't know. There aren't, isn't any data left. But it seems Dr. Clamp has been culturing them for years. Recently, it appears he was conducting utter research into artificial sperm. For Eve, of course. For Eve? Er, yes. He wanted to exclude the mitochondria from the sperm and create new sperm. <laughs> sperm, 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 sperm. Yes, he took that sperm that he created here and moved it to the hospital. There he would artificially inseminate those who would volunteer for the experiment. Then, what was that HLA list for? Professor Clamp? Uh-oh! You ordinary beings will never, never comprehend my level of research. Professor, I'm placing you under arrest as the ringleader of this operation. What you did? This isn't something you can get away with. Do you understand? <laughs> You're pathetic, Brea. Why put yourself in the human domain by reciting meaningless laws? They're meaningless. Do you understand? <laughs> um, this is when you shoot him. <laughs> I guess you haven't told your little friends yet. Your mitochondria has special powers, doesn't it, Aya? <laughs> she hasn't told anyone that she can fire fireballs now. <sighs> you can say all you want, but I'm just here to arrest you, Professor Clamp. I'm not letting you interfere with Eve. Do you hear? Or you hear? Do you understand? Aya, look out! <laughs> Damn straight, Daniel! You know, Aya, why didn't she shoot him? <laughs> Daniel, thanks. I didn't see the scalpel. Oh, she had, he had a scalpel. That would have been bad. Just in time. Why didn't you shoot? You could have been killed. I don't know. It just didn't seem real. It felt more like... Uh, he's conscious again. Yeah, you kind of failed as a police officer there. Uh. <gasps> Dollis to the res... Dollis to the rescue, huh? Officer Dollis, why didn't you shoot me? What? I know you hate me. What do you want to say, huh? Of course I hate you! Because of you, Lorraine's! Lorraine? Hmm. So I see that your boy managed to escape. <sighs> you jackass! Yep. I shall kill you way back! Someday you're gonna pay for this. <laughs> we'll see, we'll see. What are you planning to do, Professor? And now he's gonna spill the beans. <laughs> You'll love this. I'm waiting for the birth of the ultimate being. Of course he is. The mitochondria is passed on from the mother, but you see, traces from the father can also be found in minute quantities. According to Eve, her sister in Japan was unable to attain her ultimate goal because the father's side of the mitochondria caused a rebellion. Okay? Uh, none of this makes sense! For Eve to succeed this time, I created sperm without the male mitochondria DNA. So the creation was a, the creation was a success. Eve is now pregnant with Melissa's body. <laughs> pregnant? You saw the picture! How can that be? Possible? Damn! Hey, we gotta kill Eve! Let's go! <laughs> you humans are so weak! So stupid. You may be able to barge in here and do things your way until now. But things are going to change. I won't let you interfere with Eve anymore! Eve, can you hear me? You don't have to wait anymore. I- My body is ready! What? What the hell are you talking about? Damn, you made a run! She's gonna blow the whole place up! See, that's why nobody got caught on fire. So I see. Your mitochondrial power doesn't allow you to burn. Why? Why stay here and try to save me? First of all, it's my job. I'm a cop and- Or, first of all, it's my- I'm a cop and it's my job. I am bad at reciting lines. And after all, I'm a human. <laughs> like I said, humans are pathetic. I got your key! <laughs> Gonna have to get rid of all of my stuff! He is burning to death. Um, so we have a key, so we can go find Eve. Yay? Well then. So yeah, Daniel and Maida had to jump out of the window. From the second floor, I'm surprised they don't get killed during that. Because Eve 
wasn't letting her, uh, wasn't igniting everything in the vicinity. Only because of Maida. Because she needed him to help her. So once he was no longer needed, and he said it was okay, she burned everyone in the vicinity. Well, good thing they jumped out in time, or they would have been kind of screwed. Yes, I want to overwrite. I have been playing for two hours, and I'm still on day. Still haven't finished the day. That means we're gonna keep going. Can't go for too much longer before my, uh, thingy craps out. And by thingy, I mean my Elgato program, because it's already starting to worry me a bit. Okay. Hi! Kill all the things. All the things. Oh, you think you can do damage to me? That's cute. Hey! Ah, at least I killed one of them. Hi! No, don't hurt me! Ah, you hurt me. Can I hit this one? Yes! Oh, I thought that would kill him. Never mind. You hit you. Boom! Oh. Not? You knocked that shit off. You did. Um, we want the junk. I don't have room for it, so we don't want the junk. Wait, did I just... Uh-uh, this is not how we do this. I'm not trading a medicine 2 for a medicine 4. That'd be stupid. Time to go open that door that Clamp locked way long time ago. And use a couple medicines now I'm thinking about it. <laughs> it goes this way. Yep. And there's the door. Use Clamp's key and get the hell through. Itchy chest, itchy chest. Oh, um. Wait. Now I'm confused. Where am I going? I don't know. Oh wait, that door with all the goop. Durr. I'm I'm not that bright. The key must go to the room or to the door with all the goop all over it, of course. Scarlet, get your head in the game. This is because I've been playing a really long time this session. Arr. Make some dinner after this. Yeah. Gonna get in a fight, gonna get in a fight, gonna get in a fight, nope. Gonna get in a fight, gonna get in a fight, gonna get in a fight, gonna get in a fight. Oh, okay. The least fights I get into before the Tyrannosaurus Rex are the better. Well, for the most part, and of course I'm getting a fight here. <laughs> I almost want to start running away from these fights, but because of the fact that this is getting recorded, I can't bring myself to because then everybody on YouTube will see my shade. And I can't have everyone on YouTube seeing my shame of not court or not getting through every fight um, perfectly. That would be a disgrace! So take 
get to the elevator, take the elevator to the fourth floor, and open the door. Nothing can go wrong. Except I'm probably going to get into a fight here. Fight! Fight! Get into a fight! Get into a fight! Nope! Not yet, at least! Whew! I think this next room is the room with the elevator. Yes! Yes! Good. I wanna go to the... fourth floor. the goopy door! Why can't I open the goopy door? <sighs> Fine. I guess I have to go do something else? I, I don't... Game I don't understand. Game, game I don't understand. Game explain. Please, 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 please explain. Only way I can think of is there is one direction that I haven't gone in yet. So I guess we'll try over there, but I'm probably gonna get in a fight here. Nope! Okay. Okay! This is taking a while to load. Um. Okay, good. Scared for a second there. This is a little window. Eventually, I'll figure out where the hell I'm going. Hey, hey, no, bad. Of course he hit me. Boom! And now you're dead. Take on all your stuff! Now, can I get through? Okay, evidently I don't want to go back out that way. <laughs> so... I'm lost! And in another fight. Great! Hi. Hi, Mr. Monster. I'm gonna kill you now. Yeah, I yeah. am. Hi, Mr. Roly Poly Dude. Oh, I dodged one. That's cool. Ow! Oh shit! Oh shit! Boom! Boom! Na -na 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 -na. And now you're dead! Ooh, full recover. I like PE ener getting PE energy stuffs. They mean things that are good. I guess I have to go down to Clamp's area again. This way had the way that I hadn't gone yet? Maybe? I don't know. I don't know. Oh no, I don't know. Okay, so that's the way. Okay, so this door's open. <laughs> and it has one of those things in it. And another door. Good. <laughs> Hi, Mr. Guys. It's a roly poly guy. I like roly polies. 
not random killing me! I don't like those kind of roly poles. Not very nice. Mr. Roly Poly, please don't hurt me. I am the protagonist. I'm supposed to stay alive. You're dead now. Oh, apparently not. And now you die. <laughs> you give you give me darkness the second I manage to get out and kill you.